What it do, what it do, what it do, what it do, what it do. Back at you with another one. So today, I want to talk about this little rant that Brandon Jennings went on, on Gil's Arena, right? So he was saying that Jalen Brown is the number one option and Tatum's not blase splee, right? Okay, right. They People go back and forth about this topic all the time. <clears throat> and honestly, I don't think the topic is that crazy, right? Like, you know, if you think Jalen Brown better, okay, whatever. You think Tatum better, okay, whatever. But what I disagree with mostly was not his point, but what he was trying to use to make his point. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to let y'all hear what he had to say. And I'm gonna get back with y'all. Over a video game. Over the best. Right. Player. So how am I? How am I a second option? I'm the best player on the team, and I'm the Finals MVP. Because I'm the final. I'm the best player on, on the team. You can't put that much on Finals. Yes, MVP I am. And well, all the well, other stats. Well, well okay. I mean, listen. Come on, man. Listen, man. The best player. Team, the best player, player in the NBA. The best player in the NBA is the Finals MVP. Says who? No, man. Says me. So you I mean, saying Iguodala is the best player? Well, so because because when it's time player. to go oh, get crash it, out, it's me. Crash out, Mr. B. Crash when out. When it's time to go get it, and it's, we got four games to win it, right? That's who the best player is. So you're the best player for four games? The best player in the league. You're not it. You're, nobody's, everybody else at home. It's only us left. Yeah, so final, so why, at that final the MVP is whoever get hot. Huh? Whoever get hot at that point. Well, goal. God damn it, he picked a good time That's to get hot. He, he picked a great time to get hot. He picked a great time to get hot. player on the team? So, okay. <clears throat> so y'all heard that, right? Now, he went on several, like, rants. So it was like I had to try to find the one that had the most of what he was trying to say in one clip. You know what I'm saying? Because it, it was a lot. You know, he kind of went off and then he'll stop. Then he'll go off a little bit again and then he'll stop. Well, the topic could get a little bit all over the place. But basically, he was using like the MVP, right? The finals MVP. And I don't believe that you can just judge a player off of, off of MVPs alone. Especially like when you look at the circumstances, like, you got to look at the circumstances before you can just be like, oh, he better because he got the MVP, right? Like, if you watch the finals, <clears throat> Tatum was the one that was, was drawing all the defense and then making the right basketball play, and Brown was the beneficiary of that. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, you always got to put stuff in the context, right? You can't just never, I can never judge basketball off just a stat or an award. You know what I'm saying? I got to see it. You know what I'm saying? Because like, <clears throat> you can, you, it can sound good, but when you watch it, that ain't what the story really said. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't like, Tatum didn't do his thing too. You know what I mean? And then it's like, I'll be looking at it a little deeper, right? Like, the media have been trying to split these two dudes up for the longest, right? So, what's another way to try to put them against each other? We're going to give the person who normally, who is pretty much looked at as the number two, we're going to get him the MVP. To see if we can put a little riff between him and, and Tatum. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, especially in their situation because they're more of a 1A, 1B, right? It's not like you got, like, a straight sidekick, right? Like, Pippen was Jordan's sidekick. There was no 1A, 1B. You know what I'm saying? Like, no. That's what it was every night. There was no nights where Pippen might outplay Jordan and then Jordan outplayed. No, Jordan outplayed Pippen every night. That's what it was. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what it was. So it's like, how you going to try to hold <clears throat> somebody playing the game the right way against them? You know what I'm saying? Like, 
Tatum sacrificed a lot of his offense. A lot of times he could have shot it for a great shot and a better shot. You know what I'm saying? Swinging the ball, making the right basketball play. So it's like, you can't use that against them. And then your argument is an award that somebody vote for, right? Like, <clears throat> when I'm judging players, like, I don't put that much on the end. Like, an MVP never going to be the, the reason why the determining factor on, oh, well, this player better because he got more MVPs. Like, no. Players prove who they are on the court, right? Not based on some award that people vote for. You know what I'm saying? Because whether it's finals MVPs or whether it's regular season MVPs, one of the finals MVP mean you might have been the most impactful that series. That's four games. And that could be based on matchups. That could be based on a lot of stuff. You know what I'm saying? It's like Eagle Dollar got the got the finals MVP over Steph only because he was guarding Brian. You know what I'm saying? But statistically he didn't have the best numbers. You know what I mean? So it's like you still, so what we gonna say, he better than Steph? Or he was more impactful on that playoff run than Steph? No, can't say that. So it's like, you can't use one award and then just try to, you know, oh, he better because he got that one award. Like, no. And that's one, that's one round of the playoffs, right? Like, you could have had a better series than me just based on the matchup based on how the teams was guarding each other. You know what I'm saying? So <clears throat> I don't I don't really use the MVP thing, especially if two players is real close, like the MVP thing is never gonna be the determining factor. Whether it's a finals MVP or a season MVP. Because they get the season MVP wrong, I feel like more than the finals MVP. You know what I'm saying? You can go back historically and be like yeah, this guy shouldn't have got it, this shot good have got it. Like every year, the MVP is is arguable, right? It's debatable, did the right person get it? You know what I'm saying? And it's something that <clears throat> a bunch of you know who's vote for. So how you gonna, you know what I'm saying? Like how you gonna use that as your end all be all on who better? You know what I mean? So nah, that's not, that's not enough. That's not enough. Even though at the end of the day, like, it's not that big of a difference between J JT and, and Jalen Brown as far as who better. But MVPs ain't the, ain't gonna be the reason why you say one better than the other. You know what I'm saying? They gotta be basketball reasons. It can't be because one got a, a finals MVP and another one don't. Especially when one sacrifice for the other. Right, so that's what I don't get. Like, they play the game the right way. That's what make them so scary. Like, how you gonna hold that against somebody? You know what I'm saying? Like, you better because he played the game right the right way, so I can benefit from it. Like, that don't even make sense. Like, if you really watch that finals, like Tatum could have took a lot of bad shots if he really was just trying to be like, I'm the man on this team. Like, I'm him. You know what I'm saying? But no. Every team was passing out of so many doubles because the defense was collapsing on him and Brown was benefiting from it or or White was benefiting from it or somebody else was because he was making the right play. So, yeah, that's, that's, a bad, that's a bad narrative. You know what I'm saying? Because he got the finals MVP. Yeah, you know I mean, let's not let's not put them against each other no more than the media already try to do. But luckily, these two guys don't don't buy into it. You know, what I mean, they don't really they let the media argue about it. They don't it, it doesn't affect them internally, which is good. So, all right, I'm gonna leave I'm gonna leave it at that. Like, comment, subscribe. See y'all on the next one. Peace.